after the 15 minutes, next 15 minutes, I would like to introduce some of, some of the voices of Fukushima locals for over the past 10 years and tell the lesson learned from the Fukushima nuclear accident. In addition, nuclear and radiological damage, which has long threatened the very survival of humanity. I would like to consider this discuss with the participants' strategy to eliminate the damage caused by policies that included discrimination, absurdity, and the irrationality. Um, the called uh, Fukushima accident were man-made disasters. So my experience in, 90, in 1990, four years after Chernobyl, when I started working in the local newspaper company as a staff writer in Fukushima Prefecture, the coverage of the nuclear power plant was focused at the time, focused on the F2 on third unit accident that in the uh, underwater bearing ring of the reactor recirculation pump accident at the unit third of the Fukushima Daini, uh, number two uh, Fukushima Daini uh, nuclear power plants and the accident of dropping of or breaking the pump that occurs in the first day in of just the first day of 1989. The lack of safety awareness of TECO which uh, continued to operate the abnormal alarm rank and the delay being late to inform and uh, reporting to the local community and the local governments, as well as a fatigue break in the welding area resulting from the uh, later liberation of the aging. Faced uh, with an accident question in the very foundation of nuclear safety, our reporters, including me, uh, uh, would be considering on the front lines of the accident to report the news, uh, could become the first exposure scout and or the special coverage soldier as kamikaze pilot. We discussed among the young reporters in Fukushima about response to the uh, nuclear accident. What differences each company's nuclear um, emergency manuals what is the content of each media company's uh, nuclear power plant coverage manuals and the policies? And we are the active measuring um, instruments. Do we have the do we have the instruments to measuring the radioactive and iodine pill in office in company? At the time, our company's manual states that the company should approach um, at the time one company, another company, not my company, but there's a uh, national, nationwide uh, reporting newspaper companies has a manual. Uh, the manual contains the, the uh, uh, so uh, how to cover the nuclear accident, approach the front line and convey that they have seen and heard there. Another company rec recommends that the company, sh the company should keep as far away from the nuclear power plants as possible and conduct telephone interviews. Equipment such as a stable iodide table, tablets varied from company to company. We have the confronted with the question, what should we do for ourselves to cover the story or survive? Uh, are the realities of even if we follow the company's manual, we are not always able to report safety. And we need to make our own judgment on the ground when I had the, a nuclear accident. In front of the nuclear power plant, I was able to understand the absolute affirmation of safety and life. That is, if we feel danger in the field, we must take action with the highest priority on our lives. This suffering express is my source of lesson learned from the nuclear accident, uh, included in 2011. Don't stop thinking. Don't give up communicating even after the time passes. The sound on the alarm in my mind is still ringing um, with my pain, with my painful memory. Um, and the one lesson from Fukushima nu nuclear accident in 2011 is that uh, we threw away our safety myth for the nuclear industries. We have the question, I have the question, long-term damage and loss in Fukushima. If there are a deadline and the period of the damage, 
until when will it last? One of the major characteristics of the Fukushima nuclear accident human caused disaster, human made disaster, such as radioactivity and nuclear damage, is that there, there are many phases beyond our expectation. And the damage has been prolonged. It's clear uh, when the Fukushima nuclear accident occurred. It is March 11, 2011, so on. Um, on the other hand, when we can stay, this disaster is over. Is there a deadline? Do we have the deadline? Make, can we make a period of this disaster uh, damage? So if I try to say loudly, when the last one of the victims of the Fukushima nuclear accident died, passed away at the time, at the moment, the nuclear accident and damage will be finished. But um, we can instantly see that it's, it is not right. This is because of the broken reactor at the typical Fukushima Daiichi a nuclear power plant, uh, Mr. Ohashi-san uh, introduced uh, uh, clearly the melted fuel debris at the radioactive uh, uh, nuclear radiation uh, released uh, into the environment, uh, air, water, and the soil, or the uh, natural resources, con it continue to survive afterwards. It is a lifelong ghost that keeps releasing radiation in the span longer than a past of a human being's life. In 2013, uh, Fukushima City, I live in the Fukushima City, and the, in the city, decontaminated private, uh, local government started the decontamination of private residence houses of, for the residents. Since decontamination costs millions of the yens, Japanese yens, by each house, that it cannot be done by individual because it's uh, very expensive and the local government doing a uh, did and uh, was carried out by local government, but even so more than a year has passed uh, since the nuclear accident. So pollutant soil at the cleanup, after cleanup operation, there are much uh, pollutant soil uh, existing and gathering, um, but in my house, still the pollutant soil is still remain in the at the corner of our house uh, garden still keeping because the local government couldn't get the, uh, some spaces uh, keep it in or uh, um, secured in so it's a uh, limited uh, area to keep in so then uh, still the contaminated soil is existing in my house. Mr. Ichiro Moritaki, who was exposed to radiation, um, he said that nuclear and mankind cannot coexist. However, in Fukushima prefecture, included Fukushima city, uh, not only Fukushima, um, uh, Eastern area of Japan, the reality is that mandatory situation on coexist with nuclear um, semi-permanent like forever in, after nuclear power plant accident and release the radiation, release the uh, radiation from the nuclear uh, facility. It's kind of the endless damage is continuing under the radiation and nuclear damage. Clearly, uh, this negative history is a past path that must not be followed again. That's why it's not like being able to divide something, mark a milestone or hit the per period uh, in the past decade. I think few people deny this uh, assumption in reality. However, there is a reality that the period is about to be stuck on by government policies. Another uh, problem is the health damage. At the time, 2011, a thyroid test was begun for children who were generally under 18 years old or younger. Uh, thyroid cancer and its suspicion were found over 200. And now, um, the, the thyroid cancer and its suspicion were found over 250 
peep children, uh, uh, people, of whom over 200 people had an operation, remove operation or medical operation. Among the people I was covering, the measuring of the citizens who had been with my interview complained that they wanted the inspection to continue because the national government, local government wanted to stop the uh, detection or research and uh, stop to care uh, the, uh, about the health damage of, of the people. But uh, many people uh, uh, disagree with uh, the policy. So now in the discussing. On the other hand, some experts have, um, have uh, thought that examination should be discontinued. Others have also voiced that the examination will lead to the discovery of many patients and the removal of a well-faced cancer. So it's very um, um, some um, uh, doctors say that the cancer has some face, well faced, bad faced, <laughs> but the, um, uh, some um, professionals, uh, the doctor said that um, now they have the well faced cancer. It's no need to cut or remove or care um, uh, because of their well faced. So there is a movement by the government to reduce the examination by uh, to the uh, people. There is no place to present sufficient op opinions and the discussions or lack of the deliberative discussion. And there is no opportunity to uh, talk and uh, ask and uh, discussion. The people's will to inspect the cancer with long span has been ignored. Another challenge is uh, evacuation and migration. Since the beginning of uh, 2021, the number of the number of people evacuated from the Fukushima uh, prefecture to other areas was approximately uh, 36,000 people, according to a report by Fukushima prefecture government. In fact, however, the survey conducted by Kyoto News uh, Agency. Uh, from February to March 2021 this year, revealed that the total number of people evacuated from a municipality to other areas, from Fukushima to another area, tot totaled 67,000. So a huge gap, uh, governmental reports and the uh, uh, news agency. The situation of, of evacuation is diverse for each and everyone uh, in the, so, there is a huge gap between the actual evacuation numbers and the official reported. Following the earthquake and nuclear accident on March 11, 2011, some people evacuated from Tokyo and other uh, Tokyo metropolitan areas to the west of even evacuated to other countries uh, outside of Japan in order to ensure safety. These people are not counted in statistics of by government. However, it is a nuclear accident that will create such a wide area evacuation. Japan is a country with a low status of women in Japan compared to men uh, and the women. The average income is lower for women and many of them work in non-regular employment of part-time jobs. There are many women who must quit their job due to pregnancy or ch childbirth. Therefore, um, their husband stayed and continued to work in Fukushima. Uh, their husband remained and stayed and uh, continued to work in Fukushima even after the earthquake and the nuke accident. Therefore, their wives evacuated with their children to outside of Fukushima prefecture. The term of mother and children evacuation, the code uh, the evacuation types, um, uh, mother and ch child evacuation, mother and ch children evacuation was also occurred, sorry. 
um, this is another uh, form of evacuation at wide area evacuation. So I will actually introduce some uh, evacuee uh, from Japan to uh, United States. Her name is Ms. Michiko Kato, a mother who evacuated from Fukushima City to the United States, uh, California, with her son, was found to have cancer in the United States after evacuation, and she passed away. I've heard from her uh, and, uh, um, during evacuation of her, her evacuation, I met her and uh, talk and have the interview with her how difficult, how difficult to evacuate to outside to Japan. And she, at the time she studied English very hard, but uh, she missed Japan and Fukushima um, because of her parents stay in Fukushima city. We have to consider about the violence of the power generation fueled by fossil fuel, such as nuclear power plants and the nuclear weapons. So, Sometimes we just focusing on the nuclear reactors, but outside of nuclear reactors, there are many people who are suffering uh, from the radiation released after and the contaminated uh, environment. So we have to consider about the situation. So I will actually introduce that uh, another problem is lost words and uh, lost words, lost memories, and lost records. Folklorist, I would like to talk, um, introduce a, a story, folklorist, Mr. Norio Akasaka. Uh, he had a workshop with local people in the Aizu region. It's a um, east area of Fukushima, at the mountainside. It's far from the uh, nuclear reactor, about one, more 100 kilometers far from the Fukushima Daiichi. Um, and so, uh, so um, at that time, so after a nuclear power plant accident, at the time, a person who worked in the electrics at the meeting, um, one uh, participant, he was a person who worked in the electric, electric, electric power industry company. He confessed at the meeting that people from electric power companies, except TEPCO and the Kansai electric power company were saying, I jealous that TEPCO and the Kansai electric power company, because they have nuke uh, power point colonies. In other words, outside of TEPCO's power supply area, Fukushima, which is uh, generating power at the nuclear plant Fukushima is one nuke power plant colony. Now we can see that the Fukushima is undergoing new colonization, one of the immigrant colony. For example, many people have moved from the outside of decommissioning, decontamination and reconstruction work of nuclear power plants. In addition, um, um, through festival projects, like a festival slave colony forcibly implants values and cultures that were origina originally not came from the local areas and makes uh, them obey the events like uh, uh, Fukush uh, Tokyo uh, Olympic Games and some big games, big festival games. So they are focused on the big events and make uh, forget or ignore the uh, evacuation and suffering people. In July next month, the Tokyo Olympic will be held in Japan. In Japan, enthusiasm for the sporting events and the festival events in is covering people and the society as a whole and the nuclear and the COVID-19 disaster are about to be invisible. This Olympic Games is trying to build a legacy called the Olympic for reconstruction from the nuclear power plant disaster. This is a um, a Prime Minister of, of Japan said that it's a legacy, it's an Olympic for the reconstruction uh, from the uh, very severe situation of the nuclear accident. So I'd like to uh, introduce another voice. Um, 
Yeah, just a moment. It's a limited time. I have to uh, skip or uh, yes, yes. I I like to in introduce um, another uh, two person, and that's the final uh, talk. Um, I will talk to you about Mr. Wakamatsu. He was one of the testimonies who went into the nuclear, nuclear site immediately after the completion of the Fukushima Daiichi nuclear plant. Uh, Mr. Wakamatsu is a poet and uh, disagree with the uh, Fukushima Daiichi nuclear power plant. I interviewed Mr. He passed away uh, in um, April this year. Um, I interviewed Mr. Wakamatsu last December based on his experience in, he said that um, he experienced in World War II. He said that we won't be believed and deceived. It's important to live thinking with that I won't be deceived. I take it like his last um, will, um, his last voice. Um, he left to future generations. Um, I like to, he did say that I like to reform this phrase that we should be, not be fooled by the myths of safety, such as that if an accident does not occur, the nucle nuclear power plant will be safe and the accident and the Fukushima Daiichi nuclear power plants has been settled. So, it's a velocity. The conclusion. Um, I like to express the. I like to express the experience of people affected by the nuclear accident in Fukushima, as the people of Fukushima uh, that exist all over the world, who feel like uh, they are themselves. I like to express my gratitude to those people. Thank you for all of the people to come and stay in the front line with the Fukushima people. Uh, the local people of Fukushima said, I don't want anyone in the world to have an uh, same experience, the same miserable, same severe situation like ours again. So um, in fact, from the environment and human rights perspective, younger generation have been began grassroots activities aimed at anti-nuclear and non-nuclear power generation in Japan as well. Um, it's a very wonderful and uh, hopeful thing. So we have to come together beyond the generation, beyond the area, so beyond the, this severe experience. So uh, it's a, a important solidarity. Thank you very much.